Hollywood bigwig Jay Shores has married model Linda Nivoltova in front of a crowd of some of the most powerful. In some cases, formerly, people in TV, page six can reveal. The vice chairman of Utah tied the knot with Nivoltova in Italy while on vacation with pals including former CNN boss Jeff Zucker and girlfriend Allison Gala, the ex-CNN PR chief. Also on the guest list, Shores recently ousted CNN anchor client Don Lemon and Lemon's fiancé, Tim Malone. Page Six first reported the group was on vacation together and were told that Shores, 56, and wellness expert Nivoltova, 40, wanted to keep the nuptials quiet. On Tuesday, Nivoltova posted a photo of the newlyweds celebrating after their wedding with a glass of red wine, writing simply, happiest. The group was also celebrating with a July 4th bash. Sex and the City and Emily in Paris creator Darren Starr, Conan O'Brien's longtime producer Jeff Ross, and his girlfriend Lindsay Rhodes were also invited. Hollywood bigwig Jay Shores has married model Linda Nivoltova in front of a crowd of some of the most powerful. In some cases, formerly, people in TV, page six can reveal. The vice chairman of Utah tied the knot with Nivoltova in Italy while on vacation with pals including former CNN boss Jeff Zucker and girlfriend Allison Gala, the ex-CNN PR chief. Also on the guest list, Shores recently ousted CNN anchor client Don Lemon and Lemon's fiancé, Tim Malone. Page Six first reported the group was on vacation together and were told that Shores, 56, and wellness expert Nivoltova, 40, wanted to keep the nuptials quiet. On Tuesday, Nivoltova posted a photo of the newlyweds celebrating after their wedding with a glass of red wine, writing simply, happiest. The group was also celebrating with a July 4th bash. Sex and the City and Emily in Paris creator Darren Starr, Conan O'Brien's longtime producer Jeff Ross, and his girlfriend Lindsay Rhodes were also invited. Even though they were all there for a wedding, one industry source gossip. You can't possibly have all those power brokers there together and not imagine they're not talking about the idea of creating something new or taking over CNN. Indeed, Zucker, 58 who was sensationally forced to quit CNN in February 2022 after failing to disclose his relationship with Gallus as per company policy, has reportedly been making plans to buy the network. Sources close to Zucker, who is currently heading up a media venture backed by Jerry Cardinale's Redbird Capital and International Media Investments, an Abu Dhabi-based private investment fund, have repeatedly denied to Page Six that he has any such plan. However, CNN is in crisis after Chief Executive Chris Lick was given the boot last month. Following a disastrous one-year reign and with many CNN journalists and anchors turning against him, Shores was previously married for 12 years to interior designer Molly Isaacson, with whom he has three daughters, and to artist Anne-Marie Ward.